What's up guys, welcome back to another video today. Today I'm using AK Center for you. It's not my normal class setup. Um, it has a lot of recoil that not like the normal AK would have. Um, I built it basically to see if you can find any bad attachments. So there's some good attachments, there's some bad attachments. I try to balance the gun so it's not so OP. And I'm pretty sure that this thing is a hit marker machine. It is not that good with these attachments on it. Obviously, I have on my classes, I have completely, completely different attachments. And then, um, but just having some fun with it. Um, and it doesn't help that every lot I got in this morning was really, uh, sweats. So. Literally every single person. I was getting spawn camped. I went to play Nuketown for a little bit. Got spawn camped there. And then I literally switched playlists to this. And then my teammates were doing pretty good. I wasn't really. The only thing is with this class setup that is really not that good. As you can see here, the firepower is still pretty good. The speed's good. I have the 50 round mag on it. Give a little bit more ammo, but your aim down sight speed is slower. So, and the accuracy is not good like the other Nugget like, normal AK. So, that's why the recoil. Um, but the firepower it didn't really make a difference, man. To be honest with you, it was. I don't have that uh, attachment where it gives you a boost of uh, like 6% damage or whatever, like most people have on. I don't have that attachment on, so that's why it seems a little bit weaker than uh, than the normal. Wait, hey, hey, look at this! I literally kept wall banging that guy, and he didn't even, didn't even kill him. And I'm pretty sure this is uh, the weakest AK center for you I've probably ever seen. I'm pretty sure the stock the stock version is literally better than this AK center for you. Pretty sure. And then I was like, I was thinking like, I'm gonna take a break from um, doing the dark matter, you know what I mean? And I'll just have some fun, use the AK center for you. This guy will gun me with the MP5. But I, uh, I'm trying to work on the Sigma. I don't really like the Sigma. I don't know if I'm gonna do launchers, man. I'm not a big fan of. Like they don't work too hard unless it's like the kills. Um, we have to get, you have to kill someone. But I, I don't, know, I don't really like rocket launchers, especially the ones that take forever to reload. They like the Sigma. Going for the kill streak here, no big deal, and then death. But I was having fun with the AK system for you. Um, overall, with the with these attachments, I really don't think that they're that good. Obviously, I've I play competitively or used to, so I have my own different setup for it that does uh, tremendously more than this. So, hope you guys enjoy. I try to make the worst AK 74U, and it was hard to pick, man, because in this game, every attachment has more positives than negatives. It's not like Modern Warfare. So it's very hard to make a bad class setup. You know, I mean, you really have to look into it to make a bad class setup. So, um, yeah, man. But I believe this is the worst AK sniper for you I could have ever built in the game. And the AK is already strong enough, so it doesn't even matter. You know, it's like a hit marker machine, like as you see right there. But it's, you know. I don't know, it's still viable for these attachments, I just don't think it's logical and nobody would run them like that, you know what I mean? It's just stupid, but it's better attachments. But it was fun. But I hope to catch you guys later, hope you guys enjoy. If you ever, you know, want to make an AK 74 e class, probably don't use these attachments, I'm just saying. So, hope you guys enjoy, I'll catch you in the next one.